Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new Ninjago video here on the channel. My name is Tanner Fishies. In today's video, we have ourselves a bit of an update surrounding Ninjago Dragons Rising Season 3 and a recent issue of the Ninjago Magazine. Now, in case you guys have not been caught up to speed, a few days ago I made a video talking about this new comic that can be found in, again, a recent issue of the Ninjago Magazine. The comic itself focuses on Zane missing Pixel, obviously Dragons Rising so far has touched on that as well, but the comic also shows us this strange pixel looking robot, which I thought might have been a new version of Pixel. I do not get these magazines in my country, so I had no way of knowing the full context. I thought this could be some type of new Pixel. Maybe when she shows up in Season 3, this is what she will look like. Well, according to you guys in the comment section, and according to people that actually have read the comic, this is not not the real Pixel. Instead, this is apparently a clone of Pixel made by Creel or given to Creel. Some of the comments don't really line up with each other, but it has something to do with Creel, which I guess makes sense considering that this new Pixel looks very similar to Creel, at least in terms of the hairstyle. And apparently this clone of Pixel gets destroyed at the end of the comic. But long story short, this is not the real Pixel. This is just a Pixel clone, again, involved with Creel in some way. Now to that, I would say, well, I'm glad that Pixel's return is not being reduced to just a comic in a magazine that not everybody gets in their country. Because we know that Pixel will be back in Season 3 thanks to the 2025 Ninjago set leaks, so I'm glad that Pixel's return, again, is not being reduced to a comic. We will see Pixel return in the show itself, hopefully. Unless LEGO makes another horrible marketing decision, more on that later. But with that being said as well, I'm also kind of disappointed because I really liked this pixel design. Now, just reading through the comments on my previous video, a lot of people were not fond of this design for pixel. I totally understand why, but I would not mind if Dragons Rising changed pixel's design a little bit. Maybe gave her a different hairstyle, one that is unique to her, because right now she just uses the same one as Nia. Would be nice to have pixel maybe get some kind of redesign, especially following the merge and how many years she's been lost. I wasn't crazy about the color scheme, though. I do more so prefer Pixel's classic color scheme, but I did not mind this design overall, and if this were to have been the new Pixel for Season 3, I would not have been upset. Unfortunately, or I guess fortunately, depending on who you are, this is not the real Pixel. Again, just a clone. So with that being said, guys, that'll pretty much wrap it up for my thoughts here. Leave all of your thoughts down below in the comments. What exactly do you think about this new pixel clone thing in this new comic for Ninjago? Again, these comics sometimes tend to be non-canon, so I guess whether or not this is canon, only time will tell. But again, this is not the real pixel. Leave all your thoughts down below, and thank you so much for tuning in. If you guys enjoy this one, feel free to like and subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I will talk to you guys again very, very soon. Peace.